Council President, Council Members. Earlier today, Rick Kingray and myself, myself met um, with some of the Environmental Advisory Committee about item number 12. And I understand we're going to try to pull that from tonight. Um, and the reason being, they brought up some good points about having a sanitation, sanitary uh, survey. We have talked with Dr. Fung today, and she informs us that she feels like we've already had one, but I'm not convinced. So we're going to put that off to the later in the month because I believe we need to move forward to have testing done, have the environmental people involved, and really have three areas because we have David Stasel's company working with us on the sewer plant. So when you put all three areas together, I'm hoping we can come with recommendations back to the council about how to solve the bacteria going in our bay. And just to say we keep testing and testing is not a solution. I think we need to work towards fixing it. And I believe uh, Rick might comment later on that. Mr. King, right? Yeah, I just want to pick up on what the mayor said about the uh, pollution down at the duck pond and on the benches and stuff. That, uh, we met with the Auburn people last week. They made a presentation to the, the council. Uh, we asked for them to come back and give us some recommendations about how they could fix the problem. Subsequently, there was a meeting of the Fairhope Environmental Advisory Board and Gary Grover and, and Jim Horner met with the mayor and I today. And as the mayor said, we are going to try to a more comprehensive approach, and that is to have this sanitary survey done. Uh, I think there would be some debate with Dr. Fung about whether we have one that's current enough or not. But we're going to do that, have this survey, we're going to take the information that Dr. Fung uh, creates for us in the study. And folks, y'all need to understand, this is not going to be a quick fix solution. I think the good doctor said she will have to study for almost a year to take these various readings from eight different sites along Mobile Bay. <coughs> Our goal here, it, you know, I believe everybody in the room today was in agreement with this. Our goal is to make sure that we can use our beaches for swimming and that the kids can use them and the families can use them and we don't have, we don't have to worry about them being polluted. 